it's now up to you whether you will open your mind, open your eyes to see the truth. It's up to you what you believe. It's up to you what you see, what you hear and what you breathe. But now is the time to come out of this organisation that controls your mind, your eyes, your ears and every breath that you have in your life. You need now to make a decision whether you will come out of the Jehovah's Witnesses, how this will it affect your family and whether you are ready to come out now things have changed you need to open your eyes to see that they are the watchtower is lying and mind controlling you why is it that it doesn't want you to google the news because it teaches you that it's fake news but googling is telling the truth about Jehovah Witnesses so your mind is set upon everything that what the Watchtower says is true that's why it took out all its publications from its its, its contradictions and lies so that nobody could see it but you can do your research online we have ex-Jehovah Witnesses that have those copies of those publications that prove that it isn't fake news and that the Watchtower is lying. Can you see there is a problem with Jehovah Witnesses who claims to be Jehovah's Clean Organisation where there is child abuse from the two witness rule rampantly paedophiles rampantly through the organisation giggling the news to see court cases of that actual is true Jehovah Witnesses believe that life is precious and that they shouldn't go to war but 30,000 people are dying from not having a blood transfusion so the Watchtower organisation are murderers, literally taking the context of it out of date, shunning, stopping people from talking to their families and mind controlling people to make people say that from shunning that those that have been disfellowshipped or removed are evil, stopping families from being together, breaking up families you need to be able to see that that it is not new normal human life and it isn't what the bible says that we should do the bible says that we should love that is not love lying about prophecies of jesus coming in 1914 and as the reasoning book talks about the 1914, that generation, when that generation passes away, Armageddon would come. There are many other things that we could say that's wrong with Jehovah Witnesses, but it is up to you whether you still want to be mind controlled by this organisation with no education being window cleaners and toilet cleaners and not being able to have a good education, not being able to live a life and why become a slave preaching the gospel of a lying organisation. So these are my reasons why you should come out. There are many other reasons 
and many other reasons that are being put on YouTube, it's up to you to 